Hey, it's me Candace, and I'm here to talk to you today about the difference between a primary and a general election. So the primary election is where we decide which one Democrat and one Republican will be on the ticket for the general election, which is in November. There can only be one candidate from each party for each race on the ballot in November. If you go at early voting, you're gonna to have to tell the election judge if you would like a Democratic ballot or a Republican ballot. If you vote in a Democratic primary and for some reason there is a Republican runoff, you can't switch parties and then vote in the Republican runoff. The primary election in Texas is Tuesday, March 6th. The last day to register to vote for the March 6th election is February 5th. If you were to vote in early voting, you just have to tell them which pr which primary you would like to vote in. If you were to vote on election day, there may be two separate locations for the Democrats and the Republicans. And sometimes they're in the same location, so you just need to check ahead of time. In Dallas County, 13.18% of Democrats voted in the primary election. In Dallas County, 14.44% of Republicans voted in the primary election. The early voting, you can vote in any location in the county that you live in. Early voting in Texas begins February 19th and it ends on March 2nd. Election day in North Texas will be Tuesday, March 6th. Put that date in your calendar and make sure that you are coming out and exercising your right to vote. If you don't know where to go vote, I have a link in the description. Please make sure you go and register to vote. Again, this is me, Candace Quarles. I'm bringing you more information to create more engaged voters in our community. If you have any questions for me, if you have any topics that you would like to discuss, certainly put them in the comments and let me know. And please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you.